down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up, down, 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 up, up, down, up, 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 down, up, up. That was down, but up. <laughs> and hello, people. Welcome to Yu-Gi-Oh! Legacy of the Duelist. Uh, if the music doesn't sound like it's from the game, that's because it's not. I have a YouTube playlist playing because. The music in this game is the most an annoying shit in the world, because there's only like three or four tracks. But uh, I downloaded a save file to get me all the cards, because I'm not grinding in this game. <laughs> but I'm going to be using the story decks for most of it. So what this oh, game does... Wait. Oh, you have played this. No, this was an... I know why I recognize it. This was an app. This was was it? I don't I don't believe you. Yes, because I never played a Yu-Gi-Oh game on the PS4, but I did play a fucking app with this stupid robot. <laughs> I don't believe you. I'm pulling up my tablet right now. I will send you a fucking screenshot. Well, anyway, this game it takes place through the it it um retells the stories of, of the original Yu-Gi-Oh through Zexel. It says that there's Arc RV it's literally just a tutorial for Pendulum Monsters. Yeah, see, I didn't get far. But now that you mention it, I do remember... Who did I get stuck on? I did get stuck somewhere in Battle City. Um... Oh my god, this is... I love this Duel translation. Duel Monsters! Okay, this is amazing. Duel, Duel Monsters, you yeah, nimrod! nimrod. Okay, we have to actually read this. Okay, you, it's time to duel. Oh no, ta. It's ta duel. Time to duel! <laughs> yes, because this, this game is where I found my. Oh, you know what? No. Oh, okay. I have to. I, I started the tutorial. Shit, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, so it has a different name, but I'm like 90% sure it's the same fucking game. Because my app is called, um. Dual Generations. Oh no, okay, that was the previous game. Yeah, but it has the same stupid robot. Yeah, I know what you're talking about, I had that game. Yeah. So, uh, um, I, acc I accidentally even... started the tutorial. Well, why the fuck did you do that? Uh, because it's li it doesn't say it's the tutorial. Okay. Stop telling me how to play Yu-Gi-Oh! No. Anyway, alright, so we figured that Why out. Why would I want to attack with Dragon Ball here? You summon first! What if they you had a card in their hand that could destroy my monster when it's summoned? And then... That's stupid. This game teaches you reckless playing. You switch from defense after you summon. I hate this game. I'm done. We're done. <laughs> done! Alright, duel to the roses. Let's go! Well, yeah, it's actually really weird because, um, you see these little things on the side, the blue gem and the red gem? Yeah. That's for pendulum summoning, and, uh, they changed where these are, um, after Arc V. Now they're just in the spell and trap zones. Oh yeah, but didn't people throw a fit about that? No, that was fine-ish, for the most part. Wait, what do I want to tribute? Why would I tribute my stronger monster? Oh. That was... I think that was... <laughs> I, I know what Gravity Crush does, but I wouldn't want to waste that right now. But the tutorial wants you to! I hate tutorials that won't give you the option to not do the thing. Where it's like, okay, yes, I know I can do the thing, but I don't want it. <laughs> oh boy. Stop, stop telling me how to play the game. Oh, I have to chain. Ooh. Anyway, chain. what I was saying about the, the pendulum thing, the pendulum zones moving wasn't really that big a deal. It, people kind of complained, but it wasn't like the end of the world. Uh, it's, it's what they did with extra deck monsters. Because normally you could just fuse, synchro, exceed, whatever you wanted. Now they added a news. Well, we gotta read this. A card that to that powerful to 
totally wipes me out. Whoa, you said. <laughs> <laughs> you did fine, Joey. You did fine, I... Joey. I just had better cars. <laughs> what a dick. My grandpa owns a game shop, and I get all my best cards from him. Yeah, you poor fuck. Your own game shop. <laughs> what do you wait? What are we waiting for? Let's go. Okay, maybe I can even get my grandpa to show us the super rare card he's got. Little did they know that someone <laughs> was listening in on their conversation. Someone who was looking for a very rare card to add to his collection. Well, I though. Ten out of ten best character. Yes. That <laughs> afternoon, Yugi and his friends went to Grandpa's game shop. Yugi wanted to show his friends his Grandpa's prized possession. Gramps, can you show my friends your awesome super rare card? I thought it was super special awesome. Ariel, shut up. Rare <laughs> card? You mean my special- Yes, that one, you fucking idiot. Please! Please! <laughs> How can I refuse? <laughs> Blue eyes, white dragon. It, I say it's rare, but it comes in multiple structure decks. <laughs> starter deck, actually. <laughs> now that I think about it. <laughs> it's still, I think, it still gets reprinted. It was actually just it, recently... It's literally reprinted, like, every five minutes. It was literally sure. just, just reprinted, like, a month or two ago. Oh, Kaiba. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, yeah. Name your price for that, Blue Eyes! I can pay anything you want. I like how he's wearing his Battle City outfit. Yeah, <laughs> that's his cool outfit, so that's what they put him in. <laughs> oh, I'm sure you could, but this card is worth more to me than you could ever offer. Senile old fool. Wow, rude. <laughs> <laughs> what a dick. That guy needs to get laid. I need to kick him out of my shop. Oh, wait, that fuck. I just realized that was a Yu-Gi-Oh! bridge joke I made. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I was gonna do the Yu-Gi-Oh! bridge Taya voice, and then I got distracted. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the next day, when Yugi came back to the store with his friends, he found Grandpa was gone. When the phone rang, it was Kaiba on the other end, mocking you. Why is my Why is my robot voice and my Kaiba voice the same? Kaiba, you could have just bought the game store, though. <laughs> or bought the land under the game store. <laughs> or you could have stolen the car instead of the Grandpa. <laughs> <laughs> nah. <laughs> because now he has to be Yugi, take my dick! Gramps! Oh, oh, wait, no, you're Yugi. Okay, and you're well, Gramps. And you're now, now I'm Grandpa, I guess. <laughs> I want to teach that boy, Kaiba, a lesson about the heart of the cards, but I lost. Oh, you mean that thing that lets me put whatever I want at the top of my deck? Grandpa! <laughs> oh, oh, okay, Yugi. That, that, that's me! <laughs> <laughs> How's the old man feeling? Hmm? God, Kaiba's eyes, calm the fuck down, you psychopath. Jesus, man. Chill. <laughs> you know, Kaiba's never this outright evil after No, after he's this. not. Kaiba, you sleaze. What have you done to him? We had a duel, that's all. With each of us putting our most valuable card as the prize. But I guess playing against a champion like myself was just too much stimulation for the old... Whoa, Kaiba. Oh put man, it, put I'm, it, put I'm not into that. Back in the pants. <laughs> I died. I'm sorry. <laughs> look, hold on, this is not something Kaiba would say. Look at this sweet prize! <laughs> Kaiba held up he Grandpa's held up blue eyes white dragon. <laughs> oh, you know what? I love this game because I just realized the blue eyes doesn't have any text because. This was made in Japan first, so instead of replacing it with the English version, they just erased the text. I love this game because <laughs> the robot has a monocle. <laughs> Grandpa's most treasured card! Look at Tail on the side, just like, man! Yeah. It's like, but a friendship! Blue Eyes White Dragon is a rare and powerful card, and this one will never be used against me. Okay, can the, can the me think? be on the left instead of the right, like a normal Well, game? it's justified like Japanese text. Okay, but... but this I'm is... 
Vaporize White Dragon by treasure. <laughs> he just has a face like, whoa. <laughs> His eyes aren't. aren't. Yeah, they do that with him. <laughs> no, his eyes are off. Yes. One of them's off. That's fucking hilarious. <laughs> Grandpa, hold on. on. Hold on to what? How could you do such a thing? Yeah, let me yell at you instead of take my grandfather to the hospital. Yeah. Yugi, take this. Huh? Grandpa? I built this deck. I put my soul in these cards for some reason, and I taught you everything I know, Yugi. Take my cards and teach Kaiba respect for the heart of the cards. <laughs> okay, you know, Grandpa. <laughs> I love that I have fucking Disgaea D2 music playing right now. This is amazing. <laughs> you should be playing music to duel by! Are you ready to play, Runt? <laughs> Playtime is over, Kaiba! It's funny because I'm I'm Yugi in this situation. Huh? Yes, far. Oh look, it's Battle City Yugi. Their outfits are cooler! Deal with it! But we were just with normal Yugi. Yeah. Kaiba was taking a bad by I wanna get to the duel. Uh <clears throat> Kaiba, prepare yourself, because it's time to duel! Look at that fucking mouth. Yeah, it's they so, do that it's so too. squished. <laughs> they do that. To be honest, my... Okay, Yu-Gi-Oh! did have a big effect on my art style when I was younger. And it's hard to see now, but I still do the really small mouths. Do you do the really, really, really small butts? <laughs> I don't really emphasize the butts, so I guess so. <laughs> okay, but theirs are, like, completely flat. Yeah. But I did get the. I used to draw my eyes like uh, theirs for a while. And then I, I hope you didn't do it. it like you normal Yugi, because normal Yugi's eyes are weird. No, no, the cool fucking eyes, God. Oh shit, <laughs> he got Battle Ox. Oh, this is an Exodia shit. deck. Yeah, it is, because you know, you have to be summon Exodia! No one's been able to summon that before. You know what? Fuck you. I'm gonna beat you by attacking. <laughs> Give me that I'm not shit. gonna summon Exodia, I don't care what the cutscene says. <laughs> Although if I do draw Exodia, I won't complain. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if I draw it, I'm not gonna not summon it. <laughs> well, actually, you're forced to in this game. I'm pretty sure you are, yes. <laughs> but Ariel, anyway, this deck, I, this is basically like, you win the deck. Oh no! Oh, he got rid of Snatch Steel. What an idiot. Anyway, this spell card I have, Heart of the Underdog. Every time you draw a normal monster, you can draw another card during. Your... Oh. And um. In this deck is. And like you you can continuously purple. just keep drawing. Yes, yeah, see. Yeah. It's basically it's almost oh, built. Charity. Fuck. <laughs> it's almost built to be a one turn Exodia deck, if only it had I only have, normal uh... monsters. <laughs> Hold on, say again, this card sent from the field, fuck. Okay, that's not gonna help me. Goodbye. Wait, why'd you have to- Oh, right, because you have to discard things for- Yeah, you have to draw three and then discard two, which is why that's banned. If it was discard two, then draw three, it'd be fine. <laughs> oh, Achievements! Wait. No, that's achievement progress. Oh, oh. Oh, another minus... song's playing now. Yes, I want to activate Heart. Gift of the Mystical- oh no! Oh no! Oh no, Swords of Revealing Light! Yeah, I'm not gonna use it. I want him to kill my monsters, because it lets me add stuff to my hand. You fool. You played right into my tracks. Yeah, let me get this guy. Because he's not Let's a normal just get monster. Some more Exodia. Uh, yeah, you get a summon more shit. Oh, I got another oh, one. Oh, another one! Does that mean you can double summon? Uh, I don't know if it stacks. I'm gonna hope it stacks. It probably doesn't, though. <laughs> Draw! Standby! I love the standby thing. Oh, God. I mean, yeah, I. I know 
you can do stuff during the standby phase, but I just I, I love the standby phase. Oh, it's got an animation. Oh, oh, that's that looks really that's, bad. That's a beautiful <laughs> animation. It takes me way back to 2001. <laughs> Except that you know, Duels of the Roses looked better. <laughs> you know what? It probably did. It did. It's actually. It's so weird that I might actually try to record it, except again, it would. It's just fucking. It takes forever! Oh, I win. It takes forever. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna do this. You're gonna suicide? So that you can get the last piece of Exodia? Yep. No one's ever been able to do this, even so though it's so before. easy. You will play only for top death. You play only for power, Kaiba. That is why you lost. I like to think that's actually how the scene played out. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Sorry. But if you put your heart in the game, there's nothing you can't do, I guess. Now, mind crush. Mind crush. <laughs> Hmm, it seems Kaiba Boy has been defeated in a duel. I must learn more about this Yugi Moto. Okay, you know what, I love Pegasus too, but can we talk about how creepy he is? Um, <laughs> later. <laughs> after uh, after the uh, Yugi with all the package, Pegasus created a duel, and so the bar Oh, we skipped the Pegasus, I think. Yes, yeah, uh, Pegasus, no. your precious defeated a lot. Whole special duel suddenly. Str okay, I think it's just doing this as a cutscene. I'm gonna skip this because there's a lot of cutscene in the way. Pegasus steals Yugi's grandpa's soul through a VHS tape. Hey, puzzles one of them. You know, if you've seen season one, you know what's going on. Yeah. Now we skip to the <laughs> island. We skipped a whole bunch. Yeah. I don't know why they even. I mean, I guess it's because it's a force lose, isn't it? So they were just like, no. Oh, um, <laughs> the force lose duels. They just have you play as the other character in this game. Oh. Well then what the fuck? Um, so they can sell it to you as day one DLC. No, I just... Also, the menus lag in, uh, the PC version. That, or from what I've read, it's it might be because my GPU is too high? And the game sure. just can't handle it. That's what I've read. Burning land, uh... Or any field spells, destroy them during each player's standby phase of the turn. Play. Wow, this is so bad. Oh man, Ariel, I almost got the combo. I just need my polymerization and I can make my guy of the dragon champion. I'm so glad you've got two guy of the dragon champions just ready to go. I'm glad they gave me two. Wait, is it a warrior or a dragon? It's a dragon. Fuck. They could have put dragon mirrors in this deck, but no, that would have been fucking fun. Now, I know that the story duels eventually get fucking bullshit hard. Yeah. So once that happens, I'm just gonna use random decks I've made. None of them are good. Just, just forewarning. Except the harpy one, but that's because harpies are super easy to make. Mm. Now the question Riveting is... duel. Yeah, you know, I love this, this the slow burn duels. Those are my favorite. Just fucking take forever. All right, don't, Ariel. Don't how much you want about? Anything. How much you want about one of these as a man eater bug? Oh no, so Wabaku. That's food. worse. Ah! Oh no, man eater bug. Dick. I don't care about your flowers. Oh, Dick. Ariel, if I draw my polymerization, I confuse Gaia and Curse of Dragon, and then tribute my Gaia the Dragon if I, Champion. Have I told my polymerization story? No. Alright, so back in, like, second, third grade, uh, whenever Yu-Gi-Oh! was, like, really big among little kids, you know, we had our decks. I think... I think I had a Joey deck? For some reason, a what? Deck? I think I had a Yugi deck too. Um, and my brother had a Kaiba deck because I liked I liked Yami and Kaiba. I didn't like Joey, so I'm a little confused. Anyway, um, I liked Joey. I, I okay, this deck is so bad. It's a shit deck. Yeah. I haven't drawn anything that I can use. You're also getting really bad draws. 
There's that also. <laughs> well, it's bad because I keep getting bad. You get bad draws when your deck's bad. Well, you just if I lose, I'm keep it the heart of the card. If I lose, I'm just gonna use one of my decks. Um. Anyway, so when my brother and I dueled against each other, we just made up our own rules, basically, <gasps> because he never read the rule book, so he just trusted me. So I would change the rules so that I would win because I was you. a little shit. So, because we were playing by my made-up rules, I was like, I don't need polymeralization. So I traded it away to someone. <laughs> I don't remember who, and I've never gotten another one since then. Oh, well, it's fairly easy to come by. You don't, in fact, most people don't use polymerization. There's other fusion cards now. Oh yeah, I know. I don't really need it. I don't even have a deck right now. I have a bunch of cards that could be made into a deck. Would it be a functional deck, Ariel? Well, it wouldn't have a theme, but it would be functional. <laughs> I'm the type of See, I want to make a themed deck, just because I like the idea, but I'm also the type of person who hates using more than one of the same card. Oh, so... that's... <laughs> you need to. Hard. I know. That's one of the things I hate about Yu-Gi-Oh! Oh my is god, that... what is he tributing? Hercules be... You not Hercules, oh no. no, not his 1700 attack tribute monster. Um, no, that's one of the things I did. As much as I love Yu Gi Oh!, that's one of the things I dislike about Yu Gi Oh! is, um, that to have a good deck, you have to have multiples. <laughs> there actually is a mode of magic where you're not allowed to have multiples. But I'm not really into magic enough to have a functional deck to do that, so... <laughs> I, hate, I hate old school Yu-Gi-Oh so much. <laughs> this isn't even bad yet. No, it goes on for so long. I mean, yes. At this rate, I'm lit this card I have is going to burn me to death. Probably. I'm not really sure why Okay, can I just get a polymerization? Is that, is that possible? Can you just get rid of his... his... Okay, so I don't fully understand the Burning Land card because I don't have the shit memorized. Let me... uh, when it's activated, destroy all field, any field spells. During each player's standby phase, that the turn player takes 500 damage. Okay, so... Can you get rid of it? <laughs> um, I need a card to pop it. Alright, well... Draw something to pop it! Dad. I don't think Yugi has a single card that can just destroy spells and traps in his deck. Okay, well maybe you shouldn't have played that in retrospect. Okay, <laughs> but he had a field spell at the time. Yes, he did, and then he played another one. Immediately. <laughs> well, I didn't think he had another one in his hand. Well, of course he did. It's fucking Weevil. <laughs> That's all he fucking does. No, he waits five turns to summon perfectly ultimate great mob. That's what he. Does. I mean, yes, that too. But he looks okay. He fucking always uses. I swear, if this is a fucking feels, man eater, but feels God. bad. I'm gonna die. Probably. <laughs> I'm gonna die. You're gonna, you're gonna fucking suicide here. This card is destroyed by battles. Special summon one insect monster. Oh. 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 What? Hey. Oh. Okay. Um, oh boy, suicide. Hercules Beetle! God damn, that that sure is gonna help. Oh, it's about goddamn time. Oh, fucking finally. Had to go through almost half my fucking deck. Polymerization. Polymerization. You know, I wish that Brian was here so we then. could teach him how to play. Yeah, he's not gonna stick with him. He can barely read. You're right, this is a game where you have to read every card. Yeah. <laughs> Especially if you don't know what the fuck it does off the top of your head. Oh, I can tribute my guy of the Dragon Champion to summon Curse of Dragon. <laughs> Horn of the Unicorn. Oh, you said that just like Yugi. I tried. I'm, I'm glad you thought so. <laughs> oh my god. I just, this is gonna be a man here to vote. Probably. Oh no, it's a no, cocoon. it's the cocoon! Good. I've been waiting for the stupid cocoon. 
It doesn't do anything in, on the field, it has to be in your hand. Yeah, well, the Tuskegee doesn't play it like an idiot. I have three <laughs> turns to win this. Yeah, you do. Luckily, you got a lot of damage. Unluckily, <laughs> he's got a lot of damage. Errol, that, that's a man eater book. Oh god, a man eater book! <laughs> Oh my god, this card I, I should have just saved the Horn of the Unicorn. I don't know why I used it. Because you're like me and you just like doing a lot of damage. <laughs> Nothing's an attack, I can't do it. I know, you can't actually do damage, it's just it's just the principle of the thing. <laughs> you just like seeing the big numbers. I'm gonna die. Yeah, probably. I have to win. Unless next you draw turn. another polymoralization! Even then, I don't think I'll do enough. Oh, he has no monsters. <gasps> this is fine. The abduction. No, it's just a normal Celtic Guardian. Okay, so two plus thirty-two. I win. I, I still laugh that obnoxious Celtic Guardian is actually a thing. Yep. It, it's just what it's called. Why is it called? I don't know. I don't fucking know. <laughs> Woo! Wow, I actually won. Yeah, and you cut it close. This was a thrilling duel. Yeah, I almost killed yeah. myself. You're really good, Weevil. Yeah. Yeah. It's over. I've won. No! You're impossible! My moth is unbeatable! What moth? Yeah, you didn't even summon the moth, actually. <laughs> the harpy lady. I mean, harpy lady. Harpy lady? Jesus. <laughs> I'd better be the champion for Serenity's sake. She's always counted on me, even when we were kids. I'm gonna win this tournament and the prize money. I'm gonna make sure you don't lose your eye. Who are you talking to, Joey? Himself. <laughs> <laughs> A voice that annoying can only belong to me! Mom! I mean, I... <laughs> <laughs> wow, rude. <clears throat> Hey, you. <laughs> I just said you. If you want me to try, I guess I can try here. Let me go ahead. Uh, I only just realized Mai is basically wearing a corset. Yeah, basically. Hey, Yugi, are your duels going well? I might be up for a duel myself. So get ready because I choose the challenge. You, Joey. Me? <laughs> you challenge me? Did I fucking stutter? <laughs> I mean... <laughs> <laughs> well, okay then. Get ready to lose! No. Wow. Well, too fucking bad. Oh no, I probably shouldn't have used a story deck. Mai is the greatest duelist. She beat that one guy and then no one else. I really shouldn't have used a story deck because Joey's decks are filled with nothing but monsters and like two traps. Yeah, Joey's decks kinda suck. Which is why Joey is also beaten like three people. <laughs> no, Joey's beaten a bunch of people. Just yeah. using really, really bad fucking strategies. Wait, yeah. what does this do? Destroy all level four monsters. You're... I, I love specific and, cards like this. Yeah, like that's oddly specific, but okay. <laughs> oh, it's Jerry. It's Jerry the Beans, jello. man. The jelly bit pretty good. No, it's Jerry. It's Jerry Beans, yeah, it's man. Jelly. It's okay, Jerry I don't beans. Care. Jerry. It's jelly beans. I love the Konami fucking translation team. Oh no! Why? Because it benefits. I don't think you can see Harpy Queen before. This is well. Good thing Harpy Queen was a level four boss. This is fucking dumb. <laughs> Why the fuck do they have Harpy's Hunting Ground? Because she has a Harpy deck? Why does she have Hunting Ground and I have fucking Flame Manipulator? Because your blade is Joey! Why do I have He's Shield and Sword deck. in a deck that has Jerry Beans Man who has zero defense? Again, I don't really see what's confusing about this. this... <laughs> you're, you're using Joey's deck. I'm, I'm more I'm more concerned with the fact that she's having- she's using car- She's <laughs> I don't remember Harpy Beans or anything. I could totally make a Harpy's deck. I could have thought about it. I, I still want to make my Melodious Songstress deck. My, you just... 
Why would you do that? You could just use Harvey Dancer to fucking return it she's and a, summon she's it. He's a super reckless, aggressive duelist here, apparently. That wasn't yeah. even aggressive, that was just dumb. It's, it's, uh, it's like... So I said reckless, though. <laughs> she just she don't care if her field is empty after each turn. Just do it anyway. I like how all the songs that have played so far are Disgaea D2 songs, even though I have it on shuffle. I mean, I'll take your word for it. <laughs> oh yeah, you can't hear them. Nope. Oh boy, I got my other flame- actually need him. I just realized I need flame manipulator. <laughs> for polymerization. Oh, oh wait, yeah, no, no, no! Yeah. This deck has thousand- no, this, this, this deck has thousand dragon. It's fine. I don't need flame swordsman. Fuck that. Yeah, yeah, you see, they know what's up. They only gave me one flame sword because he's so fucking garbage. <laughs> you got a Regeki, though. I don't, I don't need to use Regeki. No, you don't, but you got it. In case you do. <laughs> I think I have, like, three Regekis in real life. I don't I, think I use any of them. One somewhere. I don't... Is it from the Legend of Blue Eyes pack? I don't know. Because if it is, and if it's first ad, that's a lot of money, Ariel. I'd have to find it. Because I don't, I don't think it's first gen. It might be like second printing, maybe second or third. Oh well, if it's if it's not the first edition, then it's worthless because they reprinted the packs. Yeah, they reprinted all the, the time uh, in the legendary collection. Well. I guess as long as we're on the Yu-Gi-Oh! subject, I can check. Let's see. I swear to god, if you have a fucking Mirror Force. Thank god. Alright, that was easy. Then again, it's always easy when your opponent doesn't draw anything they can use. Did you say something important? No. Uh, <clears throat> I tried to tell you that there's more to do monsters than just kicking the other guy's butt! If you're ever gonna be a real champ, you gotta learn to take care about someone other than yourself. Wow, rude. Oh, it's Mako. It's Mako. Mako Tsunami! Oh, the duel of me. Okay, I can't do this anymore. Sorry, Joey. <laughs> what were we thinking coming here with no food? Oh, he said wit. With no food! How are, are we, we ever going, going to get through the rest of the competition without anything to eat? Uh, maybe we should have thought of that before we got here, you fucking idiot. I mean, what? that's a good question, Joey. The dueling really takes it out of you for some reason. And I haven't seen any Burger Santa restaurants since we got here. I love that they're being faithful to the dub. <laughs> <laughs> I smell something cooking that way. I'm such a creep. <laughs> uh, my spells are not in this box. <laughs> oh man, I just love barbecued fish. Wait, what? Yeah, People barbecue, like barbecue fish? It's more smoked. It smells good. And I bet it tastes even what makes you think those fish are yours to eat? Um, fuck you. <laughs> I was actually that, just that... wondering that. I don't want to have things in common with Taya. <laughs> <laughs> you want to be Tristan? I, I, I can try you here. Want pointy hair? <laughs> Joey would say anything to fill his belly. Some people have absolutely no self-control. Stomach. <laughs> Joey, save some for me! Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. This robot has like a bulge uh, where his fucking dick's supposed to be. I mean, he does have an awkward crotch. Why does a robot need a crotch? <laughs> wow, these are really long. Yeah, it just keeps going. Enjoy yourselves, you fish thieves, for this is your last meal! I knew this was a bad idea! How dare you steal my fish, you bottom-feeding thieves! God, Mako. <laughs> that, that's Joey's response. God, Mako. <laughs> <laughs> a few fish that do not belong to you, 
and to steal a fisherman's catch is to prove you have no honor. Wait a second. Aren't you Mako Tsunami? The top ranked ocean duelist? Are there other he's, ocean He's top duelists? ranked because no, <laughs> there, there's no duelist in the ocean. There's no other ocean duelist, period. And who might you be? I'm Yugi Moto. Sorry about your fish. I only ate them all. <laughs> You're Yugi Moto, the only duelist ever to defeat Kaiba? What a okay, fine but surprise. Statistically speaking, he has to have lost at some point. You don't know that. <laughs> if he shoots his opponent before they finish him <laughs> off. Every time he loses, he just kills them? No, no, right, no, before they fin he, he loses. Like, before they <laughs> declare the attack. Final, and it just didn't work on Exodia because of the heart of the cards. <laughs> yes. No, the gun jammed. <laughs> Uh, sure down, I treated you a duel, I mean, the fucking... Okay. I didn't want to use a story okay. deck. Music, or my music. My magic cards are apparently in a different box. For some reason. I meant spell cards. <laughs> oh, remember how Yu-Gi-Oh used to call their magic cards or their spell cards magic cards? Yes. Apparently, they, apparently they cards. changed it because they were gonna be sued by uh, magic. Probably magic's been around since like fucking 80s. Well, Yu-Gi-Oh was originally um, it was inspired by magic. Yeah. I think the original name was something like. Monsters and wizards, or something? Or monsters and magic? Beautiful. Oh, good. Hey, here's my harpy's hunting grounds. This card's flip. You can once per turn change this card to face down defense. This card's flip summon target one monster your opponent controls. Yeah, it's okay. Uh, Ask a spell. Spring of Rebirth. <laughs> Forbidden Lance. I think it's a newer-ish card, maybe not, but it bothers me because her arm is jacked up. <laughs> Red and Lance is OP. Oh, it was. It's not that great right now. Big bang shot. Hey, Fisher. I've got two horn of the unicorn. Congrats, Ariel. You have a bad card. Yeah. I didn't say it was good. Well, Somebody. Okay, at ASEN this year, someone was actually cosplaying Change of Hearts. It was cute. <laughs> oh, they, they, they're not allowed. They're, you, you shouldn't have allowed them. <laughs> Should have banned, banned. them. Can't, Been can't. like, I'm sorry, you're banned. <laughs> Please leave. Oh, they actually did something really funny. Uh, for the longest time, Sangin was banned. And yeah. they actually had, like, card arts that told a story with Sangin. Do you know the card Tor, uh, Tor God of the Underworld? Um, I should because I've got this. Fucking, I don't remember. Okay, Off well, top she's, my head, she's, I a, don't she's a cutesy fucking anime demon chick who. She's a tour guide and has a bus. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, yeah, maybe. <laughs> and, um, in some of the card arts, um, that they, they, they have like a whole line of tour guide cards and a at one point, they eventually started putting Sangan in them. And <laughs> in one of them, Sangan gets on the wrong bus and he's being taken to prison. <laughs> because he's banned. Oops. <laughs> and then another one, he's in jail with a bunch of other banned cards. And then um, after he got unbanned, they made a card with him going free. <laughs> That's cute. Oh, this is the pile of cards where I put the stuff that could- that goes together and could be used in a themed deck. But, that probably won't. We call those archetypes, Ariel. What? Ever? It's not- it's a thing. oh, it looks- I'm not- I'm not- I'm not reading these, I'm sick of it already. 